Oh, the book. It's hot and it's coming to the stage. You guys may recognize them. TV, cable, internet. Put your hands together for Gary Walden. That's right. Oh, Gar Gary Walden, heir to the Walden Books fortune. I've been spending that money pretty freely recently. Um, anyway, uh, I'm not feeling too good. I'm feeling a little under the weather, and uh, my confidence has been shaken today because I was learning how to drive stick shift today, and uh, that was really, really awful. Because it's like having sex with someone that's like really, really critical of you all the time. Like everything you're doing, you know, you think you're in a good rhythm, you think things are going well, and then they ask you to change positions, and it's very, very awkward. Um, anyway, uh, anyway, trying something, I don't know, maybe something will work out. Um, anyway, I am, this, a lot of this material is actually from 2005, so it's a little dated, but I'm going to try to spice it up for now, but, you know, in a post-Twitter world, who knows what's going to be funny and what's not, um, and that isn't. Uh, okay, anyway, here we go. There's a bad start, we're going to start again. Okay, anyway, uh, <laughs> thank you. Uh, I had a friend die on 9-11, and uh, it's kind of a sad thing, but uh, he was in one of the towers when the plane hit, but then, uh, actually later I found out that he was gay, so it was fine. <laughs> yeah. I don't even know what I think about that. Um, anyway, so I've been actually doing a lot of uh, work, uh, community work with the, uh, the homeless, um, because I realize there's a lot of people feeding the homeless, there's a lot of people clothing the homeless, what can I do? How can I do my part? So, I've actually been out there, and I've been fucking the homeless, and, uh, <laughs> it's actually going pretty well, you know. I'm out there, I'm on the streets, making the eye contact, and, uh, they're getting something out of it, I'm getting something out of it. And it's working out well. Bareback. <laughs> I only live once, you know? <laughs> so I've been told. Um, I don't really know. Anyway, thank you. Uh, I guess another thing uh, that I was thinking about is, that makes me very sad, uh, is that sometimes, you know, you see a retarded girl, and she has really, really big tits, and that's a shame, you know? I mean, that's really, what else can you say? Come on, I gotta know my God. Anyway. <laughs> but uh, anyway, sorry, I can't really see because I lost my glasses and these are my friend's glasses. So, um, <laughs> so anyway, actually all the comedians tonight are very, very attractive and I like that. Um, that's it. Um, anyway, okay, oh, here is something funny that I was noticing. Uh, <laughs> okay, anyway. You ever break up with somebody or you stop seeing them or something like that? and it's a little awkward, and you wish you could send them maybe like a letter or something that said very seriously, very sincere, I wish I had fucked you better. You know, that was not my A game, and I'm sorry about that, and if given the chance, it would have gone down anymore, but I need that kind of feedback, you know, maybe if you could have filled out a form or something that I had, you know, I need to get copies of that, man. I need to go to Kinko's and be like, listen, my love life is not good. Um, anyway, so, oh, actually, another funny thing that happened was, I'm not from LA, um, so being here is very weird, and I see a lot of celebrities, and that's strange to me, because I'm not used to that, but whenever I see them, there's that moment of recognition, where I see them, and they see me, and they know that I know who they are, and it's very, very awkward, and I feel like it's a lot like seeing a war criminal, you know, like they're on the streets, maybe they're getting, you know, their groceries or whatever. They just want to live their life. And, you know, they were just following orders. And I think that's okay. Not saying that, you know, celebrities commit war atrocities, but some probably have. Um, anyway, I really wish I could play that piano right now because I think that would really jazz things up. But I can't, you know, maybe I'll hit one key. Hold on one second. Just one. That's my masterpiece. Thank you. Thank you very much. But uh, anyway, so if anybody would like to buy me a drink or something later, I would appreciate that. And maybe I'll do the same for you. Um, I'm Gary Walden. That's my time. Thank you.
One more time, Gary Walden. Woo!